Welcome back to this playthrough of Defender's Quest. Uh, last time we entered into this city, so hopefully we can learn some more about the man in red and his powers. Let's see what our next battle is going to be here. Ah, a lone knight joins the party and shows off his armor-busting skills. Ah, perfect. It's just the guy we were looking for. Let's see, do we want to advance? No, let's just stick with normal. Get some knights going here. I'm just saying, if I were planning a city, I'd probably pick a different place. You know, something that doesn't have millions of tons of explosives sitting underneath it. Look out! They come again! Who the hell are you? It's me, Marcos. The knight has an armor break skill that weakens uh, armor with each hit. I can smash the armor right off these fiends. If I had a body. What's going on? Pause quick. Oh yeah, he yeah. oh he has an armor pierce and an armor break tray. Awesome. Alright, so, um, the archers can go somewhere like here and here, probably. Let's just do that, actually. Let's put an archer here, an archer here. Marcos can go somewhere like here, where you can hit them both. Put an ice mage. No, that's a better idea. She'll get hit by every everything as they come in. Hmm. I don't know. I know we want to boost him, so let's do that. Let's boost him some. Let's boost them some. That's pretty good. Let's put down a healer unit. Here. Oh, that's perfect. Let's just do that for now. See how well his attacks do. So he's got a 14 speed versus 15. So his, his speed's not too bad, actually. No, oh, and look at that. The archers are just taking care of him. I, don't, I almost don't even need him. But he does way more damage to them, so he's still a good unit to have. It'll be good when we can buy a few more of those, and we can go back to some of those old levels and uh, beat them all. Play all! Play all! Uh, I need a berserker now. Speed's a 14, even though he's been leveled up three times. His speed's a 17, so it's a big difference there, too. Let's see, does he hit the corners? He does, because I'm thinking of putting an ice mage in each cor corner, like that. Help slow everybody. Those guys can just batter them. Yeah, that'll be good. Seems like we're handling them pretty easily because I mean, look how much more we've got left to do. Taking care of this pretty easily. Nice. Does make me wonder if I had just put four archers here, if they would have just mowed him down or not, though. Really 
don't need to boost anybody. And we got them here. They've only got one guy left. Nice. Nice and easy. Ezra survived unharmed. Let's see here. Oh, Ezra just short of level up. There's Marcos. Yep, he was going in that spot. Okay, nice. Let's see, Keta, uh, Poison. Oh, let's keep increasing our range. Range is so nice. Uh, let's get for 10% chance to raise. And this one, Holy Light, all foes. Dark foes take extra damage and are easier to hit when he gets that one. That one's nice. Let's give him group heal, or her group heal, I suppose. Oh, and slag level up also. Let's give him um, answer for bleed also. What's this one? Chance to evade enemy attacks. Oh, that's nice. Swipe. All foes in range. And Whirlwind. All foes in range. Nice. Three hits per foe. Wow. Whirlwind's pretty nice. You got here just in the nick of time. I am in your debt, lady. It means little in this world of chaos. But I stand by the tra uh, traditions of my family. A life for a life. I am in your service until such time as this debt has been paid. The Royal House of Ash demands no less. Royal House? You are a... A minor royal, to be sure. But the blood in my veins still demands that I uphold the family honor. It is we who are honored, Prince. Do not bow to me, lady. It is I who must serve. My blade is yours to command, in whatever endeavor you undertake. I mean, within reason. None of this stand on one foot and sing the tipsy tiger song backwards in falsetto. You would be amazed at the crazy ideas people will get when they hear a life dead. A tipsy tiger song? Don't even try. Ah, oh, to town. A former or a fort inhabited by former guards of the, of the pit, hiding from vengeful plague survivors. I did not expect to find anyone still living in the citadel. The residents of the pit have little sympathy for a guard who finds himself infected. On a side note, mob beatings are totally not all they're cracked up to be. Anyway, some of the older veterans remembered the Citadel's secret entrance, a place where we were free from reprisals. But even here we are not safe from the plague. The Armored Revenant. They were once members of this camp. Every one of us that dies of this infernal plague bolsters their numbers. Then it is not safe for us to stay long. Let's see here, who can we recruit? A knight! Austin, we already have Austin. Zerk. Yes, Zerk, you're hired. Oh, uh, there we go. Zerk actually has color. That's always nice. Alright, let's go back and look now at armor. But they still have all that fur armor to buy, which is highly expensive. Oh, and now we have even better male armor for everybody. And, uh, let's see, weapons. Uh, oh, so the new guys need the better swords, we need better bows, we need better stabs, oh my goodness, they were gracious. Let's buy these guys a better better sword for certain. And we're out of money. Hey. Hey, yep, I can't even buy one bow. Dang, hey, everything's so expensive. Hey. You intend to press further into the city? It is imperative that we reach the royal records room. 
The information there could turn the tide of this disaster. I should warn you, there are more dangers in this city than just the Revenant. Creatures of fire sleep here in the dark places of the earth. We will face whatever dangers we have to. Still, a word of warning. Here there be dragons. I've always wanted to say that. But seriously, my friend. Dragons. Simp safe. Let's go back to uh, this one. Even though we barricaded the door, we can easily escape and no one will notice. See? Just that stealthy. Because we should. Yeah, we should easily be able to beat this one. We've got soldiers that are on level 11 now. This will actually probably be really easy at this stage in the game. Uh. I don't know, I'm thinking I should just put down more archers. <laughs> Let's just see what they do. And we'll put down more units if we feel the need to. There's an armored unit there, but that's it. I mean, I think another archer is all we really need. Yeah, we're gonna put down another archer. None of these guys look that tough. Speed it up a little bit. I think we're just gonna mow them down. Yeah, look at that. Eesh. Armor or not, you're still a gunner. And these back archers can still reach over there also, so yeah, we're good. We'll just boost this archer when we can, but they're just wrecking them. Get out of here, worm. Yeah, look at that, they're just destroying them. Perfect. Get whatever that item was, that's all. Those items are always nice. Items you get off winning the extreme challenges. So yeah, we just destroyed them. Nice. Azra survived. Uh huh. And she leveled up even better. Frenzy! Oh, he can take Holy Light now. Let's give him that ability. Let's increase everyone's range still. Austin can get some bleed attack. Oh yeah, look at that. Foe takes 20% more damage from future hits for 5 seconds. Wow, that is nice. That's really nice if we could get that pumped up some. Oh, we forgot to level up the new knight. A swing, smash, armor pierce. Ignores several points of armor. Armor break. Attack destroys several points of armor. Knock back. Chance to knock back and counter. Huh. Interesting. Armor training. Bonus to defense. Bonus to attack. And then these are all attacks. Oh, that one's lunge, 50% chance of stun. Oh wow, that's nice too. He's really good against one strong foe. He's not good against groups though. He doesn't have any group attacks. It doesn't look like at all. They're all one foe. Huh. Interesting. Well, let's get him a point in everything for certain. I see. So he can increases his armor piercing. I see. Uh, sure. That's fine. Yes! We got Glory of War. This exquisite quaid armor luxuriates in style. Each ring of mail is blued, and the last rows of the shirt are gilded to create a golden border. The reinforcing plates are ornamented with gilded patterns and prominently display the symbol of the Imperial family. Scratched into the surface of the metal are the quaid words, How late it is to think on these things. Several more words are scratched around the corners of the plates, but the haste in which they appear to have been written has rendered them illegible. Let's see. 
kind of armor we've got in here. Uh, click on somebody else. It's an 18. Sure, let's equip him with that. That's a lot better armor for him, an 18. And I can give this weaker one to the next guy. Perfect. Awesome, so we've gotten one, two, three, one, two, three, all the way down. And now we've got all these ones to do. Oh, we still got a bunch though. And I'm still very broke. Hmm. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go right here. And I'm going to play like 10 battles in a row and just get us some more experience, some more gold. So that we're a little buffer because I feel I feel a little weak right now for some of these challenges like the basic battles were winning pretty easily so I think I'm gonna farm that for a little bit and when we come back next time I'll tell you how that went and show you how our heroes are doing uh, so until next time <laughs>